Okay, let me just stop. Oh. You're kidding me, right? I have to fight all these fellas again? Really? Okay, well, um, I guess we'll be back. Actually, yeah, let's listen to the Chronicle of Arkham. I completely forgot that I scanned this. Oh, nice. Anyways. <laughs> Anyways. So, I was, uh... Oh, did it now? Huh. Oh, that's not good. But he had none. Understandable, but, uh, yeesh. Well, hmm. I wonder if there was more to that that we didn't hear. Whatever, there's going to be a lore episode anyway. Sorry, fellows, it's just going to happen. Um, so, I'll start with saying, yes, the pistachio crusted chicken is very good. It actually cooked all the way through. I was surprised. I first pulled it out of the oven after the allotted amount of time. and um, It was actually properly temped when I put my handy-dandy meat thermometer in there. So, I guess the moral of the story is to actually check it before you turn the oven off. Um, then it'll pretty much always be right, because that's my luck. But, you know, even more fun stuff, I was, uh, how did I never do the Zaz is counting on you to find his work? Did I really never do that one, seriously? Um, I was playing a lot of Dead Cells earlier today, right? And I look outside, getting stronger. the I sky is, now. like, yellow. I'm in the middle of like a full-blown dust storm, <laughs> like a, a full-on dust storm, you know. Um, so that's super cool and good. Also, you know what I never did? I never did the remote control batarang, which I can use probably to take out this guy. Boop! What a loser! All right, let's get at it. It might have been a better idea to not do that the way that I did it. But what's he gonna do? Shoot me? Oh, okay, he might. Now that I've. Howdy, fella. Does it? Um, was she saying something important? Was there something important going on that I didn't notice? Hey, guy, how's it going? Um, I gotta say, the fact that I could hear her voice from. Uh, anywhere is a bit concerning. Hold on. Let me just destroy this pod really quick. Live in the pod. Um. But yeah. Really very interesting. Uh, so, that's messing up my internet. So I can't watch my epic podcasts and play my Steam games anymore. I gotta say, this world is no longer worth living in. Um, but... <laughs> So I, I guess I'm going to be reading before bed instead. The funny part about that, um, specifically, is that I've been reading Children of Dune. And even more specific, I was reading the part where um, uh, the main character is about to brave a massive dust storm. <laughs> so, yeah, really feeling in tune with the characters tonight. Oh yeah, I'm definitely... In a, mut in a super similar position to... God, I don't even know how much is really a spoiler. Because uh, Children of Dune is like book three, right? So I would actually... Okay. I, I, I wouldn't say that like names alone would be a spoiler, but I, I don't want to... I don't want to say like anything, really. Now that Dune has become... You know, something that has a bit more popularity than just, hey, this is some science fiction novel from, what, the 80s? I don't know. I don't even remember. Frank Herbert's an interesting guy, but I don't... I don't remember. I honestly don't. Uh, I might do a bit of secret hunting in this episode, just because I can. But, 
Uh, let's not actually spend too terribly long on that, because that's eating into just what I ought to do as bonus episodes, because I, you know, just love doing that to my viewers. Anyways, what's... Is there some, supposed to be something in this freaking boathouse? You'd think so. Based on the idea, you know, there's probably something on top of the boathouse. Ah, uh, yep. I'm a genius. No snarky words, Edward Enigma? Very careful about uh, saying his name. Very, very careful. Um, yeah, good times, I must say, but, you know. Oh, what, I can't jump on top of the amber lamps? That's right, I'm bringing that one back. Ah, real good times, I'm sure. There we go. Sheesh. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing. Actually, I should probably check the map, but, you know, that would be way less fun than looking for little trinkets, I'm sure. Definitely way less entertaining for the viewer. Okay, I know what I need to do. Fine, I'll continue the story. Uh, sheesh. Did I never... Of course I did. I don't know what I've done and not done. Again, I'm just gonna have a bonus episode at the end of the series. Or multiple. Um, whatever works. This is probably one that I haven't done. Just because it's like, uh, kind of stupid to have to line up this stupid thingy. Behold. Yep. I know it. And this might... I can! Dude, this thing's got hella range. I'm really appreciating these upgrades, because they're really easy to do now. Anyways. Very nice. Oh. Are these guys alright? No. They're not. Well, dang, that sucks. Oh! This is Zaz's work. What, are they covered in cuts? No. Well, anyways. That sucks for them. I don't really care all that well. I care. I care, okay. I care a little bit. Um, I can only care all that much for things that I had no means of uh, doing anything about, though. So, yeah. Honestly, I'm, I'm really weighing the possible benefits of actually picking up all the secrets while I'm here. Because then I don't have to come back over here. Uh, maybe I'm already I'm already doing it. I'm already I'm already on my way over here. Really, I'm sure it makes you wonder what I could possibly be doing now. You know, um, but whatever. I swear, this thing you just pick pick a direction and it'll you'll you'll win pretty much. The last one, yeah, probably on top of the medical building on one of the corners. Medical facility. Of course, it's got to be in the furthest possible corner of this entire darn island. This accursed place. Whatever. Oh, jeez. You really almost flew off the side of the building there. For a trophy. See, the thing, the problem with a bonus episode to collect all the Riddler stuff is that if I beat the Riddler before beating the game, then I get uh, some silly, goofy dialogue options or whatever. That'll be cool. Some cool little dialogue lines. I'm sure everybody wants to hear those, especially at the expense of watching me run around the island without really doing anything cool or interesting with my... Uh, epic commentary skills while that happens. Yeah, I know, constantly mentioning it really, uh, really does wonders for how people view my abilities, you know? Uh, don't think that isn't lost on me. <laughs> Anyways. Ultra Bat Claw yet again, here we go. Or not, here we go. Try to use the A button for no dang reason. Um, yeah. You know what, just because I mentioned it, I'm going to talk about Children of Dune. I've been, or just Dune in general, I've been, I, I've been really liking the Dune series of books. Very cool, very good books. Uh, though Herbert's manner of 
writing, uh, I'm not going to say that it's similar to my own because I don't really have, uh, I don't do a lot of writing, but I like it in that it is complex as a writing style in a manner that is technical as opposed to just being floofy words, you know? Like, y things will be described in a manner that makes sense. What the heck is even in here? Really? Okay, it's a good thing I thought to do that, because it's not like this had... Okay, they got pumpkins on them. Okay, fine. You know what? I'm already over here. Let's take the uh, fun way to the um, Arkham East. I thought you said Weast. Anyways. I might even want to just do multi batarang on these. What do you think you can how are you? How are you speaking right now? Do they know? So you consider yourself a plant now? Well, all right. Let's just get a little insecticide. Or I guess uh, herbicide. Oh, will you now? Why do I doubt that? Where am I even going? Oh, hey, that looks like something. Um, hope, uh, or not. Well, uh, it was almost a good jump. There we go. I swear all of this is super important for me to do right now. It's definitely important that I do this at the moment. Yep. See? That was totally very important. Actually, um, yes it is, because I, uh, get, um, uh, um, uh, um, um, uh, I get, um, uh, I get experience, um, every time I beat the heck out of, uh, Riddler challenge, so, um, this is actually beneficial to the gameplay, because I will have more, um, uh, um, uh, freaking, <laughs> yeah, I definitely need to keep talking like that. I'll have more upgrades by the time I get to the end. Which is nice for me. I do like having upgrades in this game. Okay, cool. I really love not being able to... Whatever. It is kind of weird that... Um... Ew. See you, stinky. These things look like they would... Uh... Oh, come on. He's got no aim... No aim, honestly. It's a wonder that he can hit anything. Towers over the city. You will pay that man. Will I now? I get the feeling that might not be accurate. Ow. Yeah, honestly. For once, I agree with the Joker. Can she, like... Oh my gosh. Oh. Sheesh. I was just gonna look at the freaking waterfront, man. Okay, pal. Not my intention. I believe... Uh... I don't know what, do I just look at the cityscape? The tallest building or something? Ah, eh, whatever. We'll find the Wayne Tower eventually. Because, of course I have a tower. What <laughs> what kind of rich person would I be if I didn't have a tower with, a, like, my name on it or something? Like, seriously. What do you think I am? A simple millionaire? No, I'm a billionaire, which means I can afford large buildings with my name on them. Please don't shoot me. Please don't tell me these things have, like capability to set off my position to um, um, tell people my position is kind of what I mean by that I don't think it's happening but uh, let's just get over here first hey pal how's it going yeah just kidding go heck yourself dude ow 
Don't worry. He's going to forget that I'm here really soon. I'm sure. He'll think that I left. Why wouldn't he? I don't think the bat line's really going to help me here. Or maybe it will. Hey! Good, nice. Well, here's what we do, fellas. Haha, -ha, sucker. And now there are no more snipers. Seriously. The JFK administration should have just tried this one simple trick. Okay. Meh. Too soon. Well, whatever. Um, oh, you know, there's probably something nice over here that I can do. Like this. Literally didn't even think about it. I just moved my thumbs in random positions. I gotta say, in life as in video games, if you just move your fingers in, in weird, wacky ways, it should get results. Sure, pal. Uh-huh. Ah, really? Interesting. Joker? Sounds like, uh, sounds like she might have known that it was the Joker. Hmm. She knew. She knew. Oh, she didn't know. She really didn't know? Are you kidding? Oh, why do I doubt that? Oh, whatever. Please, there we go. Ugh. Anyways. Well, back into the botanical gardens then. Um, I guess we'll be doing that on the next episode. So, yeah. I'm not gonna line out my best work. I won't, uh, won't mince words here. This maybe wasn't the most, uh, stellar thing I've ever put so out. But... Sugma, how about that? No, I don't, actually. Uh, I'm sh- well, okay. Never mind. <laughs> well, if I see Ivy, I know I'll be doing a lot of coming. I definitely needed to put that in the video. Yeah. Anyways. Till then, like, comment, and subscribe. Or I'm... Yeah, um... Gonna throw you into a massive dust storm. I guess. Sheesh. It's still going out there. It's like, it's blowing like all heck out there. And I, I don't actually know what's up with my internet because it, like the computer says, full bars and all that. So there's something up with the connection. I'd imagine it's air quality. All the dust in the air messing with uh, whatever the hell kind of waves are coming down and going up and all that. Um, well, that sucks for me, huh? Anyways, goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.